where we keep all of our old documentation and books. We're here at night in the archives at Fulton County Probate Court. This is an opportunity for researchers, genealogists, to come and actually view some of the historic records that we hold. Probate Court used to be the official record keepers of the county, and so we have documents dating back to the 1840s and before, the, before Fulton County was or is what it is now, which is a combination of Milton and Campbell counties. And so here in Probate Court, we're excited to bring history to uh, our customers and to people that do this type of research in hopes that it can better bring understanding to families. I focus with local government and visiting them and seeing if we can help them in any capacity. And part of that was coming out and visiting Fulton County probate a few months ago and seeing what condition their records are in. And very good condition. There are a few things they can improve, but honestly, they're one of the best in the state. I looked at some of the historical documents, um, specifically the marriage records uh, the, of the colored residents of Fulton County dating back to 1865. Uh, December 1865 was the oldest one and it was fascinating to see that African American people shortly after the end of the Civil War were getting married in Fulton County. The important thing to take away from this is that we don't know all that we have, so we are inviting partners and historians to look through our files and tell us some of the Georgia statesmen and landowners and key historic figures that are located in our records that we just don't even know about. So uh, it's more about what we don't know than what we do know, and we are excited and are looking forward to the journey of learning what we have.